Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Roxanne and this is my channel. <laughs> um, it's been a really long day. I have quite a few videos actually to do tonight. Um, you're going to see those ones before this one. Um, I'm going to release this one at a later time. Um, so if you're watching it now, yeah, you'll know that I released this. Um, I went over another video on why I am going to be using um, Jeffree Star's items. Um, I fully <laughs> know there's a lot of back, um, a lot of stuff going on with him right now. So I fully expect <laughs> to get some backlash for this. But know that um, I'm just a small YouTuber. I'm not going to really make a difference at this point in time. Uh, not only that, um, I've already purchased some of the Viz items. And I'm not just going to throw them away. Um, and I did purchase some more things because they were 50% off. I, I really do like his stuff. Um, it's made in the USA. Even though I am Canadian, I tend to buy more Canadian made items and support Canadian companies. Um, I will say that I am very happy to buy the Jeffree Star items that I did because they did support Americans, especially over COVID. He did um, pay their wages and um, apparently he has a really good health, health care plan for them. With that being said, a lot of multi-million dollar companies don't do that. So he's a smaller company and he does do that. As for himself, I'm not even going to leave a comment on himself. I don't know him personally. All I hear is what other people have said. Um, so I am not here for his drama. I'm here to show you the makeup that he has come out with, to show you how I would use it and how I'm going to use it. And I'm going to show you what I got because, yeah, it was 50% off. And I was like, yeah, because most of you know that the drama has led to Morphe cutting ties with them. And I mean, that's that's on them, that's not on anyone else, so I figured I might as well pick them up, 50% off. Why not? And again, so I got the, um, I actually have all three sets of his uh, brushes now. Um, they are nice brushes. Uh, had I known that they were all individually wrapped like this, I would have just like ripped them out. Okay, so um, there's one set. I think I have some. Yes, so I think the this set is like a duplicate of just his, some of his eyes. It's the eyes and face one. As I throw one brush on the floor. Um, oh, I have a little garbage pail, but it's like over there. I also was told that his setting spray is really good and it smells like cotton candy, so here it is. Um, so I will use that. I wish you guys could see my table. It's like full of pink stuff and pink is one of my favorite colors. Um, I really wanted this brush set because it was so cute and I didn't want to pay $60 for it so it was on sale for 33 I really like the case on this actually this is a really nice cute case um, so let's, oh, okay there's a little plastic thing in there okay so I'm definitely keeping that case and I'll probably keep it out um, so these brushes are really cute um, I've got to wash up a bunch of my brushes which I'm planning on doing this weekend as as far as I know I don't have to work so there's a lot of repeats, but I mean, you could always use repeats. Um, here, one second. I mean, these are super cute brushes. Okay. These will likely be the last brushes I buy myself because I do not need any more brushes. So, okay, so we're five five minutes into this, so let's get started. I am going to turn my fan because it's getting warm back here. It's raining outside right now, so. Um, 
I am going to use this vitamin C from Smashbox as my primer. Mm, I love that smell. I think she's just going to play on a horse. My Becca under eye. I do have the e.l.f. one. I was going to use it, but I decided not to. Um, okay, I thought I pulled out the concealer, which I didn't. Okay. So, into my big bag. Oh, that's why. Because I pulled out this instead of this. I do like his concealer. I find it's one of my favorite concealers. I do have the translucent powder and the lip scrub, which I'm going to do now. I don't know if you guys remember those like little spearmint leaves, but that tastes, that's what it, that, that tastes like. So good. Okay. So I am going to use the Misha. I don't think there is a, it's funny how the mighty have fallen. Okay. So there is no, <clears throat> oh, I have the sponges so I'll use the sponge so I'm going to use my Misha perfect cover BB cream I find that this cream is really nice and light and I like it a lot okay so there is that I don't know you guys can see that I won that um part of with a lot of my my Jeffree Star stuff actually and the first Jeffree Star item I was given was um the uh, blood, red blood, blood palette. Oh my gosh. Yes. Ah. So, okay. So when I, oh gosh, oh, it's been a long week. I'm still on. It's like, it's hard to do these videos when I know I'm taping them ahead because like I don't know when I'm going to release them and I like taping some ahead of time so that like if I'm not feeling well or I run down or I've got something planned I still have some content coming out that's why I like releasing them right away so I can talk about current events and yeah so it's really hard really really hard so that's why I try not to talk about things too far ahead. So. And my face is finally starting to heal from that massive breakout. So I always get hormonal acne. And it is the worst. Get them all nicely pressed in there. Okay. Can you see my bags under my eye? Hopefully no. Okay, so I'm going to see if any of these brushes so oh, so sharp. Okay. Oh, this is star. Berry. I thought somebody said it smells like cotton candy. I'll have to. I'll have to see what it smells like. I'm not gonna open it yet. I'm not gonna use it yet. Okay. So I do want to. Oh, excuse me. More. It's really crazy. I was uh, watching a video today, and I was like, oh, I think I'm gonna make that. So I came home and I made it. Cause that's how I roll. So I'm gonna use the Morphe. 
eyeshadow primer. I'm going to put it on now because if I don't, you know me, I will forget. Okay, so I am going to use Jawbreaker because I just got this before all this sh shit came down. Yeah, I'm going to swear. Sorry, guys. Sorry, ladies. Sorry, gentlemen. Just... So here it is. Um, it's too beautiful of a palette not to use. I do like the movie. Um, I remember when the movie came out and I was like, this could never happen. Those are the colors there. Oh, right. I like. I mean, I could just stare at this all day. I'm going to use Bite Me today and Cotton Candy. Yep, it's going to be one of those days. Bite me. Got the setting spray. It's supposed to smell like cotton candy. Mm -hmm. Are you going to do a cotton candy eye look? Maybe. You should see my new pretty brushes. Oh, I forgot chocolate, didn't I? Sorry. She was watching her sister earlier, and I said I would get her something. I got her pop. Though. Okay, so. And I also got out my lip liners. Like I have everything just sprawled over here, so. You okay? One thing I've noticed about his is that they do kind of go out a little bit, but. All right, so let's kind of spread these out. And obviously some of these are the same brush. Yeah, so these two are the same brush. But, you know, that's okay. All right, so I am going to use the color, I think I'm going to use the color bubblegum, and then I'm going to go in something a bit darker. And yeah, I have something really fun and I'm wearing red, which kind of sucks, but oh well. Okay, so his mirrors are really great too, like. So we'll go in and we'll go a little higher than I usually would because I'm going to probably fill this in with something a little darker. Oh, that's a nice brush. So I have done one look with this before, and I really can't remember what colors I used. I think I kind of went for more of a subtle, I think I used orange juice, cotton candy, and maybe snack. That color jawbreaker though. Oh. So I remember, I don't know, I don't think they have them now, and I definitely don't think they'd be out right now, but I am used to get jawbreakers like with no plastic or anything around them. So... Like, I definitely don't <laughs> think they're out definitely at this time, so. Um, but, yeah, I remember watching the movie, and I'm like, this could never happen. But, I mean, it was, well, it was a movie at the time, and I didn't realize how big of a, like, you know, a cult it would become. Okay, so I'm using the JS5 and the other one, and the other, whatever you want to call it. Oh, my gosh, I just realized there's a shade called, fuck. That's not me swearing. That's me saying the shade name. But it's orange. Okay, so I am going to actually go in with Cherry Wet. Like this could literally be the only palette I ever owned and I would be happy. You know what? The one thing I have to, you know, people are like, you need to stop talking about this, but like, seriously, like, the pigments on this thing are just crazy. Okay, so, I am going 
to do Okay, so I'm going to do cotton candy. Like, how do you fault something that looks as pretty as this? I think I need to blend that one eye a little bit more. Class. Like, my other question is, is how am I supposed to go through this? Like, even if the pans are super, super tiny, which they most likely are, I don't understand how you go through, like, pan something like this because it is, like, so tiny. Like, seriously. Like, you don't need a whole lot is what I'm trying to say and obviously I need more sleep because that obviously did not come out the way I needed it to yeah so I'm gonna I'm gonna take more of this bubble gum and I'm just gonna kind of put it up here a little bit you can kind of see it just at the top there So then I'm also going to take the color Jawbreaker and I'm just going to, I did not expect that. Ooh. Okay, so I am going to use the, I think I used Bite Me, but you know what? That's okay. I am going to add just a pop of purple to this pink, pink, pink look. Just going to put it at the edges here. Very similar to a look I just did with the, um, Lorac, Lorac, I don't know why I keep saying it that way, palette. Oh, my back hurts. Again, one eye looks good. Well, no, it doesn't. <sighs> That's not the makeup spot. Alright, so with that being said, I'm going to take my little smooshy and fix it. See, I got this one, like, whoosh. can I do that with this one? No. No! Because that would be too easy, right? You can't do things too, too easy. Nope. No, you can't. Oh, at least I can't. Okay, so this has gone up too far. I don't want it up that far. So let me see if I can... Of course not. Okay, so I used cherry wet. That's what it was. Okay, so this is what I'm going to do. I might have to do this eye over a little bit because, you know, actually, you know what? To be fair, I could just do the mistake that I did to this eye, to this eye. To be fair. Okay, so... I think I'm using just the wrong brush for this. And that's all there is to it, so I need to find a new brush. Okay. Okay, guys. Are you laughing at me right now? Because I know, in my head, I am laughing at myself. 
definitely laughing at myself. Okay. It's funny this morning I woke up and I was looking in the mirror at work and I'm like, it looks like I like just punched myself in the face. I had a black eye. Hi. Oh, hi. She sees my makeup palette. She's like, ooh, that's so pretty. Oh, hi, ooh. baby. Oh. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Did you just say, wow, baby? Hi. Hi. Yeah. Yeah. Don't, uh, don't you dare put your finger in that, please. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yes. That is green. And blue, yes. Pink. And what color? And pink, yep. Can you tell me what color that one is? Wow. No, it's close. Wow. It's it's a it's a pink. Yeah. It's a different color pink. Okay. Yeah. That. That one's yellow. Can you not put your finger in it? I just said that. I know you have a memory of a toddler, but. Yeah, that's pink. Yeah. Sorry guys, I know this is 20 minutes long and you're like, shut up and get to work. I'm just going to stop doing this eye. Nope. Yeah. Huh? What is that sound? Is that rain? So yeah, I'm going to take my fluffer duffer here and I'm just going to. Yes, there you go. Okay. No, 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 no. Don't you dare. I don't want you playing in this one yet. <laughs> I see you. I'm going to take the color raspberry. And I'm just going to go under my eye here. Let's see if I can... I don't know if you guys can see too, but don't you run anywhere with that. I see a bit of a purple haze there, so I'm just going to grab my Kind of clean that up a bit. There we go. She's stepping on all my plastic wrappers. <laughs> okay, that's a bit better. It's not as straight as this one, but that's okay. We don't need no. it to be perfect, do we? No. Nobody but our fancy friends at home are going to see us. No. Okay, so I am going to take the color Gumdrop. Which is a soft purple. I don't know if you guys can see that. And I'm just going to kind of bring that down. It's a lot of fallout in this one, unfortunately. So I just kind of want just a little tease of that purple. I don't really need it that purple and I am going to use the color I think bubble gum as well just get a little bit this is a really bold eye but something fun we did something kind of team last video which you're not going to see in order because I gotta stop doing that okay so this is a long video, and I apologize. Okay, so I can just show you quickly what I did here. So I use bubble gum there, the jawbreaker there, which that jawbreaker I'm going to put on my lids next time. Um, cotton candy and bite me, as well as cherry wet under there. The raspberry is my eyeliner with gumdrop and bubble gum again. Yes, so I, I'm going to put that back, so 
but doesn't get. So I am going to put some of my pretty, which this weekend I am hoping to do some washing. Well, you know what, I'm not going to do the transition powder because I have the setting spray. That's right. Okay, guys. So I'm going to use my e.l.f. And I apologize for the little missy back here. <laughs> Can I have that? So this is the primer infused blush. I do like it. Can I have that? Thank you. Yeah, whoa. You want to try a bit? I just accidentally put my finger in there. Okay. Okay. I accidentally just like jabbed my finger in there, so. Now with purple, I have nice pink. Whatever. Maybe I shouldn't label this video as what not to do. Don't get, don't put your makeup on with your toddler bouncing around. Put the mirror in front of you instead of off to the side. Do I look pretty? I don't want your tongue out, you goose. You're such a goosey goo. It's actually not bad looking. Okay, so I'm done with that. Okay, so let's give this a try. No, I still have to do my lips and my eyeshadow, so. Ready? What? Yeah. Put it on your face like this. On your face. Not on your mouth, honey. That is. That smells good. I really like that. All right. So, um, let's see here. I know I think I... No, you cannot have these, honey. So, last time I think I used doll parts. I am going to use... I'm nude this time. Oh. <laughs> I have to say, like, the doll parts, I didn't really notice that much of a difference, but now that I exfoliated my lips before putting this on, this is just gliding on. I don't have to do the short. Hold on, honey. And that's almost nude to me, so that's kind of crazy. Okay, so... I think this is, no, this is Thirst Trap. I really like this color. It has a different applicator. So this is the color I think I got a few weeks ago, and I haven't really tried it. I tried it once, and uh, I kind of did a wear test on it. But then I got drunk, and I forgot to... Uh, look at myself at the end of the day. Yeah, yeah. Shouldn't say I got drunk, I just got a little tipsy. Oh no, yes. 
So using it with the, um, oh honey, careful sweetheart. So using it with nude is kind of like really, dampens it down a bit. Anyway, so there's this, the, the look. Um, oh, mascara. Yeah. Pretty sure I forgot that the other day, but yeah. so I'm gonna use the Lash Princess. Okay. I think this is one of my favorite looks, I, even though I th feel like I messed up a lot. Okay, so there it is. This is 31 minutes long, so thank you guys so much for watching and let me use my um, <clears throat> Jeffree Star st stuff. And you know what? I'd apologize if it was cra really crappy <laughs> palette, but it is not. It's like the perfect palette for me. No one else for me. I won't speak for anyone else. I really do like it. Um, I do wish I didn't slather on the highlighter but hey that's what happens in life so thank you guys so much for watching i hope you have a great day and please make sure to like share and subscribe